Dijon had recorded just their third win of the season against Nantes a week ago and travelled to the Alliance Riviera to face a Nice side who were free-falling down the Ligue 1 Conferrama table. After another disappointing 1-0 loss against Lazio in Europe, Lucien Favre's men hadn't won in their last six league games. The home side did welcome back Mario Balotelli, aligned with Alessandro play in attack, both men scoring eight of Nice's 13 goals. And Balotelli was involved right at the beginning of the first half. Cosiello playing him in, he gets a touch. Batis Reni dives on the ball to deny the Italian striker. Les Melu then won the ball back in midfield for Nice. Played in Jalet on his flank. It's a shot saved once again by Reyna. Nice putting more and more pressure on the visitors' goal. And it is once again Jalet coming up. The former Paris man shooting at goal. And this time Rene with his feet denies him. The deadlock was broken when Alassane Player was fouled in the box. Penalty awarded, clearly impeded by the defender. And that only meant one thing. Mario Balotelli would step up to take the penalty. The Italian who had already converted two this season. Up he went. Scoring his sixth goal. Third from the penalty spot. Mario Balotelli, Nice's top scorer this season. Lucien Favre's men up 1-0 at the break. They dominated the first half but we're still in danger of a Dijon comeback. Mario Balotelli then had a glorious chance to widen Nice's advantage, but Batis Reine once again stopping the Italian striker, a duel throughout the match. Dijon started coming into their own a little bit more. Samaritano forcing the save from Benitez and Samaritano then once again involved as they desperately try to claw back a goal, takes the ball off his teammate and his shot goes just wide of Benitez's left post. He's had a glorious chance to go forward. Dante seems to be fouled but then Reyne has a phenomenal save and then in the 89th minute silly foul by Mario Balotelli the Italian doesn't realize that the referee awards him the red card foul on Yambere from behind maybe a little bit harsh but in the end Nice put an end to a horrible run in the league with a deserved victory over Dijon Lucien Favre's team distanced themselves from the drop zone and leapfrog their opponents who dropped to 16th.